Hey guys, welcome back to the channel today. I hope you are doing all well. Um, welcome back to another installment of um, God of War Ragnarok. Now, obviously, in the last episode, we found the norms. We wanted to know what was going on with Atreus and Kratos' fate and everything like that. Um, they didn't really speak much. It's just a load of mumbo-jumbo. But yeah, join us today where we're still playing as Kratos and hopefully we're going to start making our way to Asgard soon to find out what really is going on with Atreus. And with that being said, guys, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. It's completely free. Like the video. And now let's get on with today's video. Yeah, so I absolutely have no idea what's going on here. Just uh, no idea whatsoever. Um, I don't know, I'll probably switch to the Blades of Chaos for the time being. Whilst, uh, yeah. Whilst we're still in the frozen lands of Midgar. we still got Freya with us, that's good. She ain't left us yet. It's always nice to have another ally, especially when you're charging for war. She wants to make an army before going to Asgard. She probably wants to go all out war against Odin, but it's just like, oh, I don't know about that. We're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a might rusty at that measure. We've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. It's I very don't true. That, brother, but it's hardly my point. Get some more hack silver. Yeah, so also when we found the norms, um, they predicted that Heimdall was uh, plotting to kill Atreus and now obviously Kratos just wants to save his son. Oh, smash that, didn't we? No, wait, where, where are you? Where are you going? I wanted to pick that up. Pick you up. Right. Oh, hello. If you want to get out of here. Oh, true, she's got a point. I don't know what's over there, but uh, I'll come back Look, at another I time. We're missing the norm's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently, my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Oh, here we go. Look, it's a raven. It's a raven. Yeah, that's another raven. That's five out of 48. As you can tell, I'm not doing that great with him. No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my... Your nature. Well played, Norms. Wow, this is just... the world of fate. Completed. I still have n absolutely no idea. I think the plan is to go back to Sindri's house. I think that is the plan. Uh, I don't know where R is and I don't know where N is. I'll come back at some point and start doing all of this. Oh, look, there's the wolves. Uh, we're off skis, mate. Where's the wolves? Oh, they're up there. No, we're going back to Sindri's now. Screw it. God, Sindri's house. Let's go and plot our next plan of action. Now tell me of this power Heimdall wields. Uh, look, yeah, guys, I apologise that I'm not talking much. It's just that, you know, when you haven't played a game... My intent like, I know what most people do, yeah. Most people, they play through the game first without you knowing. And then when they go to record their series, they're, they're, they're more than happy to chat over all the talking and all that. But obviously, because I'm doing my first playthrough with you guys, um, at certain points when they're talking and all that, um, 
Uh, I, I, for, I, for, I, I forget that you guys are listening in, and it's just like, oh damn, I need to, uh, I need to keep talking so everyone don't get bored of the video. But at the same time, I do feel like my uh, my audio quality in my mic is not also at some point right, no matter how many times I fiddle with the settings and all that. I mean, I'm using the Blue Yeti, but obviously because my setup, because my setup's in my front room. Uh, I think I need to pack my front room out more with stuff because uh, I do believe it is a little bit too e e echoey here in the front room. Oh, what does he want? What do you want? Oh, wait, I'm plotting. You're back. They're back. Simmer down. I see them. Oh, I'll talk to these two then. I have news. Oh, did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need him. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Oh, well, here we go. If we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do, but... Go fetch drop near. I'm going to send off you, pop. Drop near. I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole drop near. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. I will help me kill Heimdall. Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. <laughs> Here are teeth. But to even store Dropnir, you need. You were saying. So now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger. I will not allow harm to come to him. This is a bit freaky. Oh. Do we get to control Sindri? Oh. So are we going to watch Sindri get this drop near? Going on here. It's a ring. Oh, I'm going to miss you, little one. Oh. <laughs> Got it. I think. It's a ring. That's mental, mate. We are all worried about your son. We... Enough. Heimdall's a threat, not only to Atreus, but to everyone. He's Odin's left hand, and he carries the horde that begins Ragnarok. If we have the chance to eliminate him, we and should... And just as likely a trap, because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention we'll have to visit... the lady. Oh, really? Oh. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> uh. Ow. Kratos? Whenever you're ready. 
Well, I've got to go to Spartal Vime to um to get the materials. Oh, lady, no idea what he's on about. Brother. Yes, I do. Yeah, I do. Nice. Ah, time to go see the lady. Yes, I'll mate. take it from here. Oh no, this whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. You heard him. Quit your Fred. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. What the? <sighs> no, you pimp shrimps. Think that'll keep us out? Well, think the fuck again. They tried to lock us out of Spartalheim. Spartalheim? I'm, oh, I don't know. I can't pronounce it. Sorry, guys. I'm butchering the names what here. Not that. The gate. What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in need of a been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursion and you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. As he always does. Got ways in and out from the old days. Gates said never even think to look for. On account of being stupid. Oh, here we go. Let's go. And we are back. Brock, where are we? This here's your stop. Abandoned service time. Direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right prick for this, brother? I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so calm. All right, let's just get cracking. Um. Please listen. You have to let me take Brock's place. He can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask again. But. Okay. I just like blowing stuff up. Oh, Sindri's gone now, anyways. It's not his fault Atreus ran off, you know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? What are you insinuating, Highness? Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants conceal a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok, <coughs> oblivious to the only rational candidate, the one who fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. Well, he's entitled to our opinion. Come on, let's just let's just focus on. Oh, damn. Oh, I'm going the wrong way anyways. But it's fine, we can get this big gold chest out of the way. I don't know what it's going to have in it. Oh. These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture. <laughs> I no do actually. The sigil arrows should work with ice as well. Oh, brilliant. That's actually kind of sick. Uh oh. Whoa! Switching. 
Oh, come on. Oh, mate. Oh, finally, beat the big thing. Nice one, Kratos. Well, that was a bloody heartier sort of grim. These won't be easy tunnels for the dwarves to take back. I don't know where we're going. Yeah, but how? You'll be happy to know that. Um. Ah, you've seen these troughs before, haven't we, brother? Yeah, we have. Just got uh, here. There. That word. Shall we? Oh. I'm just sitting here quiet again, man. I do. I, I do apologise. I'm just being an idiot. I'm. I'm really, really sorry. Right, we're going to take the lift up to the forge now. Let's start making our way to go and see this lady. Hey, young, grab some for the lady. Grab some what? The wind. The wind? No, you idiot. The sound of the wind. Oh, watch and learn. I think I'm going to the sound of the wind. Dwarven magic's all about the intangibles. The relationship between the stuff what you can touch and what you can't. It's about understanding. See, I, 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 still, I still would like to know the reason behind the nature of the things. Why Kratos chose to take Brock instead of Sindri. Hmm. 
like, <clears throat> do you think that Kratos is, um, do you think Kratos is blaming Sindri for Atreus running away? I personally, I personally wouldn't put any fault on, oh god, here we go. Too easy. Look at that health. We're almost back to max health now, thank God. The lady of the forge. Ain't no more magical creature in this whole realm. Why, I've been waiting for my chance to meet her since I was knee high to a Noki. But since oh, wow. I'd never have it, said a two on two. But today's finally the day. Whoa, I got goosebumps on my bunions. <laughs> well, here we go. My bro, I've never seen you so. Never. It does not work. Huh? What is it this time? Out of the way. Let me. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> Do I gotta fix everything in this dang city my own self? I'm gonna need a couple of things. Follow me. Oh. This place ain't in some disrepair. It's disrespectful, I tell you. Well, what now, mate? I need that axe of ours to go kiss that material out yonder. The spiky silvery star. You'll figure it out. Wait, so where, where have I got to go now? This lady. What does she do? This stuff? Well, we'll both see soon enough, won't we? I know this, though. Okay. If we're real lucky, she'll give us a blessing. It doesn't give Chop. a damn piece. But the one she does, Look, all of that for that tiny done. thing there. The axe? Well, that particular process was a whole nother cluster. Maybe sometime I'll figure that game. Right here, mate. Is this enough? <clears throat> He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of you. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from the taste in men, of course. Now I need a chunk of that bronze material over by all that busted up wood. Right now, bronze material. Oh, God. Back in those days, I get so caught up in trying to be the best that I... Look, look how big it is, and, and we're just taking a tad little chunk out of it. Look at it. Look, look at it. Save your extra effort for See, Kratos is the god of war, man. He could have just, uh, like, literally, like, just punched it, and he could have punched it out of place. Wow, Goaty, you sure did give up on that riddle in a hurry. I give up nothing. Gets bigger the more you take away, is it? That's right. Hmm, sorted. It's desire. Nope. What do you mean, nope? Desire only grows when you take away the thing you desire. All right, oh, that was quick. Perfect, but let's hear your answer. Oh, you won't get it out of me that easy. <laughs> right, come on, we're going to go or what, Brock? Come on. We're recording a video here. Right, let's get back to business. Thank you. One more crank to turn and it's onto the forge. I see no forge. You don't see the form of a forge, but we're going to nature it. I was almost following him for a moment there. Right, is this good? Are we good to go? We're good. Crank it. Let's go. Whoa, we're going underwater. Where is the forge? Here she comes. What the? She looks like a cat. She does look like she looks like a cat. That's a big ass cat. That's a big ass underwater catfish, isn't it? It is. It's a catfish. What is she doing? 
Oh, hello. Whoa! We got a new weapon. Even Kratos gets a new weapon. She needs the final ingredient. The blood of a god. Give her your hand. What's she going to do here? Oh, that was easy. That's the God of War symbol. That is sick. Wow. The weapon's turned back into a ring. How do you activate it, Kratos? Oh, that's sick. I like it. That's going to be the thumbnail as well. Galvatrator almost forgot. Ma'am, it would be an honor if you might. Bless you, Doris. Are you, uh... Hello? Hello? The fuck was that? She acts like I weren't even here. Mermaids don't speak to our corporeal bodies. They speak to a part of our soul. Part specifically, you might be missing. Oh. Ah, oh, Brock had his dreams crushed, man. He wanted to ask her out on a date. Damn it, Sindri, you lion cat scrubber! I knew it. I died. I fucking died! The fuck you want? It needs a blessing. Yeah, well, the one to give us the blessing just fucked off into the tomb. Now are we gonna. It needs the blessing of a great blacksmith. What? No, no. I can't bless shit. Yes, she can, you Brock. Have all my soul bits. It, the blessing wouldn't mean squat. It is the nature of a thing that matters, not its form. See, Kratos is trying to cheer you up, Brock. Come on, man. All right. May this weapon strike true. May it be wielded with wisdom. May it be put down when its job is done. Let us return home. Yes, let's return home. Ah. Oh. Now you know I can't let you take our new gal home without giving her a twirl. Look, we got volunteers. Oh, come on then. We'll do this quick fight and then we'll pull the video here. Oh, I like it already. Oh, this is sick. I, I, I like it already, mate. Nah, get out of here. Oh my God, this is quicker than the axe. Fantastic. Oh my god, this this weapon is sick, bro. May! Oh my god. Oh, I think we found a new weapon. 
We, f we found the new favourite weapon. Look at that, mate. We're just absolutely annihilating people. You can go behind me, but I'm in the I'm in the kill animation, mate. Oh, come on. Come on, I can't hit anyone now. Oh, now the big guy. Oh, mate, that is just sick. It is just... That was just sick. Oh, that's how you throw one. Oh, that's how you do it. Yep. Guess we're doing this one boy style. Wait, no, hang on. We're going to get back down. Any reason why? It's because, look. It's up there, mate. Yay, yeah, number six. I wonder if it might be oh. visiting the region. Right, anyways, guys, we are going to end today's episode off here. I hope you have enjoyed. Uh, if you have, then fantastic. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you enjoyed about the video. And I will see you guys in the next video. So with that being said, guys, keep smiling, stay positive, and peace.